Hey everyone, I have a fast method that you can use to determine a shooter's dominant eye. Whenever you're working with a new shooter, it's important to determine which eye is their dominant eye. We could spend an entire video talking about the importance of using the dominant eye. But for the purposes of this video, we're just going to focus on how do we determine it. Well, historically, there have been two primary methods, the Miles test and the Porta test. The Miles test is where we form a triangle with our hands and fingers. So in this case, we put an object in the center of that triangle. I'm going to place the camera lens in the center. So as I'm looking at the camera lens with both eyes open, the camera lens is centered. I'm going to close my right eye. When I do that, the camera lens remains centered of the triangle. That means that I am left eye dominant. I'm going to open my right eye and now close my left eye. And when I do that, I no longer see the camera lens. I actually am seeing to the left of it when that happens. So the eye that keeps seeing the lens is the dominant eye. So this test confirmed what I already knew. I'm left eye dominant. The Porta test uses your index finger or thumb. I'm going to use my index finger now and actually point at the camera lens, and I'm going to focus on the tip of my index finger. I'm now going to close my right eye. And when I do that, my index finger is still on the lens. I'm going to open my right eye and close my left eye, and when I do that, my index finger moves off of the lens. Again, indicating what I already knew, I'm left eye dominant. But is there a faster and better method? Well, that's subjective, but I contend there is, and that is the paper towel roll method. I actually thought I came up with this method on my own years ago, but a quick search of the internet will show that this is actually a valid technique that many people are using. I used it to determine the dominant eye of my kids. When they were younger, their attention span was such that I could not get them to perform the miles or Porta test, but it was easy enough to say, hey kids, look at dad, now kids look at dad through the paper towel roll. And when they would do that, they would inevitably take the roll to their dominant eye. So in this case, again, I'm looking at the camera lens. I'm going to bring the, cam the paper towel roll out in front of me and slowly start bringing it to my eye and inevitably it ends up on my dominant eye. So far in my test, it's been 100% accurate. I went back years later and tested my kids when they were older with the Miles and Porta methods, and it confirmed what I had learned years ago with the paper towel method. You can use a toilet paper roll, but sometimes people get a little squeamish about that. I'm not quite sure why. Hey guys, give it a try, see if it works for you. And if it doesn't, you know, let me know. Because again, so far in my test, it's been 100% accurate. Until next time, you all stay safe and take care.